I will say in relation to the rhetoric from the Greens on this issue, um, they didn't, uh, and I checked the parliamentary record, mm -hmm. they, they may voice opposition now, but when they had the opportunity to vote in the parliament on this legislation, they remained silent. They, they may voice opposition now, but when they had the opportunity to vote in the parliament on this legislation, they remained silent. But in relation to rhetoric, in relation to 1050, uh, that, that was absent in terms of formal opposition in the parliament. Madam Deputy President, I rise on behalf of the Greens to express our opposition to the Rural Fires Amendment Vegetation Clearing Bill 2014. And there are three principal reasons why the Greens oppose this bill. The first is it will give landowners and occupiers a false sense of security, um, uh, and a sense of security, a false sense of security that may ultimately put them at risk of bushfires. The second is it will reduce essential interaction between the Rural Fire Service, the experts, um, and uh, the people who can give the, the best advice to landowners, it will reduce that interaction between landowners and occupiers and the RFS. And thirdly, that it will create unacceptable damage to a large amount of environmentally sensitive oh, bushland across the state. One, this bill creates new 10, what are called 1050 vegetation clearing entitlement areas. We're subject to um, what, we're, what is yet to be publicly provided, the, the, sorry, we're subject to the yet to be publicly provided 1050 Vegetation Clearing Code of Practice. Homeowners and occupiers and landowners can clear trees within 10, 10 metres and any vegetation apart from trees within 50 metres of their home without having to apply for permissions that would otherwise be required. 